do this with our fifth grade band members. Uh, you guys look fantastic. You sound fantastic too. Good luck. Um, I just want to take a moment uh, to thank Mrs. Rispoli, our band instructor. Uh, Mrs. Rispoli works in several buildings. Uh, so she has a crew like this in many more buildings than just West Fremont School. And the job she has done, even during our virtual time, has been fantastic. So thank you for that. during this time, and so I want to thank you guys as well for working so hard in school and as well as at home. So thank you to the students, thank you for the families, for being patient, working with them, it's fantastic. And I do want to point out, where did he go? Oh, Mr. Crawford. Mr. Crawford is here. He is the band instructor at Barclow Middle School. Um, and he's going to be here to watch our students perform and uh, remain here afterwards as well. So I want to wish everyone good luck. Uh, thank you very much for coming. Uh, and this is Rosfoli. I'll let you take it over from here. Thank you.
And now we have three volunteers who are going to play a little tune for you. show you how that would sound with the whole body. 
body of the instrument. So that's what happens when a noisemaker turns into a beautiful instrument. The saxophone section is going to play a little bit of a familiar tune that needs no introduction.
a more brass instrument, and this instrument's a little bit on the taller side, but the great thing about it is it goes on the shoulder, this shoulder, and part of the weight's behind and part of the weight's in front, so anyone can play this instrument no matter how tall or not tall you might be. I had a student once in fifth grade, Lindsay Andrews, from a long, long time ago at the Old West Freehold. She was about four feet high, and she used her foot to get sixth position, but she grew into the trombone and turned into a wonderful player. This instrument uses the same buzzing technique as the trumpet, but the vibrations are a little lower and slower. The mouthpiece is a little bit higher, and the great feature of this is the slide. So this instrument gets longer by pushing it out. The students are going to start by buzzing their larger mouthpiece. A little bit bigger, I don't know if you can see it, than the trumpet. Now they're going to put the instrument together and play a sound. One of our volunteers is going to demonstrate the sound when it slides down and up. <laughs> and now our other volunteer will play a little tune for you. The trombone. The band is back again with the most difficult piece on our concert. This is the one that's in the furthest page along, and this uses actually six pitches. So the students now have, in the winds and brass, six different note names they can play. Um, it took a lot of dedication and hard work to get to this point, and the students are excited to show it off to you. It's called Twinkling Stars. Drum. 
oftentimes felt and heard. And there's one more thing that I'd like our volunteer to play for us. Go for it. Did you hear it ring? And it stopped? All right, wonderful. And that's the drum section, percussion. It also features the snare drum and the tom. So it's the same drum, but one's turned on and one's turned off. Um, before we finish, I would like to thank all of our family members for coming today out in the rain. It wouldn't have been a concert without rain, rain, but at least we're inside. And I also want to thank you for all of your support and all of your help and the 5,000 emails that I send you and you read every one of them. Thank you. Um, the students have been phenomenal so far. We do have the rest of the year to go. Um, I do understand there might be some recruitment from our middle school band, so stay tuned for that. We're going to be preparing for that as well. And if anyone has any questions for Mr. Crawford, um, he's going to remain for a few minutes after the concert, but you can also give hugs and congratulations for a few minutes too, because we're going to hold on to them for about five minutes or so. So thank you all for coming. This is called Lightly Row. Thank you. 